I really hope to um, learn more about procedures or ways that I can better breastfeed my child because I did not have a good experience my first time. Um, the first time I breastfed my son, it was okay. We didn't have any issues, but I, I think I need to relearn, and there's probably a lot of things that have changed as far as technique, and I just want to be able to give him the best experience possible. <laughs> yeah, I keep hearing like the stories about women not being able to produce enough milk, or it's hard when they first have them. It's stressful. <laughs> started Julie's Village so that I could help prepare expectant moms so they would not have the same experiences that I did. My journey began at a community research day, which was by the Meharry Vanderbilt Community Engaged Research Corps. Leading up to that event, um, I had felt very alone. And so when I learned about the event um, and the possibility to be connected, my nonprofit Julie's Village, with a researcher, um, suddenly I felt some hope. I approached the Meharry Vanderbilt Alliance team um, and presented what I was doing with Julie's Village, that I was trying to do research so the event, the best baby shower, could be modeled so that I could take that to different markets. My work has been in the area of maternal child health and research. And while she was having those conversations, some of those Meharry Vanderbilt Alliance folks who I've worked with for years contacted me and said, oh, have we found someone I think you would really like? As a researcher, I felt like a partnership with someone like this, I felt like I could help her with what sounded like what her needs were, but also in our own work in trying to move some of the breastfeeding efforts forward, so I thought it was really exciting to have that opportunity. It's nice, it's developing this partnership and we sort of keep each other honest um, <laughs> about this whole process, and then I think we'll be in a much better stead at the end for being able then to take on a, a full-blown research project. We know there's barriers and obstacles, but how can we help her overcome those? So that is one of the reasons for the preparedness um, and prenatal focus. Overall, I thought it was great information given. I think I, I have a little bit more knowledge and I'm still going to do some more research to see what I can do and what I, I'm able to do. There are a lot of things I learned about not, not giving up and things I probably did not do correctly the first time, but a lot of things that I have learned.